Hi everyone, Lowen Smith from the Mortgage Center. I got a uh, call today about a client who wanted to do some renovations on the home when they bought it. And they said to me, but I don't have the money for doing the renovations, I'd like it built into the mortgage, is that possible? Yes, there's a few different ways to do it. Um, one of the most common programs is Purchase Plus Improvements. And under that program, the way it works is you borrow money. I'm going to use nice round examples. Buy a $100,000 home, you put 5% down, so $5,000. You have a $95,000 mortgage, but you want an extra 10000 to do some renovations. The way that it works is you have to first get a quote from a contractor that explains what the work is going to be doing and what it and uh, the cost that it's going to be to get that work done. You're going to present that when you do your mortgage application. So when you write the offer, you need to get a contractor in there right away to get that quote because your mortgage broker is going to need it in order to submit it with your deal to the bank to ask for that extra 10000 You won't be able to get it afterwards, so you have to do it as part of the transaction. So they send in the application, CMHC and the bank looks at it, makes sure that the work that they're doing is appropriate for that price, and if they approve it, then the full amount of the mortgage gets advanced to the lawyer's office but you don't get your $10,000 to do the renovations. You have to do the renovations first, provide receipts, provide proof that the work is done. Oftentimes, they'll require an appraisal to go through, an appraiser to go through to make sure that the work is in fact done, and to then they'll release the dollars to you. So if you're doing a big round, you want to do $40,000 or something like that, you can still do it, but you have to have the means to come up with the cash to pay the trades and materials in advance, and then the mortgage money will come to you later. So yes, you can use the line of credit, or you can borrow money from family and friends, but you have to have a way to get the work done first, and then they release the funds. Now, is there times when there's you can get around this? Yes, but generally you need 20% or more down payment in order to set up a structure like that. If you're someone in either of those situations with less than 20% down or more than 20% down and you want money for renovations while you're buying the home or after, give me a call from the Mortgage Center. I'm Rowan Smith.